once again today I am at the 1850s mansion at the closed Catholic school you can see it in the background It's a nice big house. One day I'll take you inside. Uh, not, probably not today, but one day. You know, you always wonder what it was like when this house was built. Um, I do know all over there was empty all the way up to about 1940 or so on the overhead aerials. I know where the driveway was. Um, so this sidewalk area here and that asphalt area over there on the other side of the shed were actually part of the driveway and it came and it made a circle around on the other side of those trees to a couple pillars you see made of peanut stone down there and then Well, it actually came in that way, <laughs> and then it went where the asphalt is, and it went back out. Not where you see that overgrowth over there. So, uh, the last time I was here, I did ignore most of the pennies. Today I'm using the AT Pro, because I walked all the way around the corner from where I parked, and I grabbed this, and didn't know that I must have accidentally hit that on taking it in the house and it's dead the headphones aren't so I will be working without headphones today for the most part and well one bonus is you'll get to see exactly what uh or well you get to hear not see you'll see two but you get to hear what I'm gonna dig up so yeah pretty nice old house I mean it's too bad like the porch wood isn't the original wood but you know it's been almost 200 years since this house was built so still very cool all right let's go find some good things okay first thing i found it gave me quite a chase came up a solid 45 all the way around i don't think it's real gold though i mean i'll have to clean it and see pretty dirty right now but that's it I'll give it a clean in a little while I don't know what it is part of an earring maybe all right let's see if we can find other things so here we have a high signal of course now it's jumping Says it's deep. I don't necessarily believe that, but and as you can see, I'm actually on Pro Zero Zero Discrimination Sensitivity One from the top. So we got a mid tone here and a high tone there. So I'm gonna dig them both, but I'm gonna have to turn you off while I do it because I got this bush right here. So, see you in a bit. <laughs> Good thing is that leaves a three. Eh, it could be sumac, I don't know. All right, so it's in the plug. Figure we'll find it together. It's probably trash. Nope, it's a coin. It's a penny, and it's a memorial penny. All right, I already found one of those, and I knew I'd find a lot today because I left a lot of those signals. But this really didn't come up in the penny. Make sure there's nothing else. All right, we're gonna find out what the mid-tone is right here. All right, I decided not to go for the mid-tone because it started jumping after I got that penny out, which was right there. Right here, I got, I don't know, it's gonna be hard to see, but. I've already walked around it. It's 86, 87. So that we're going to try out. It's small. And right there. So let's check that one out. We'll have to we'll live dig this one. Some All 
right, it's in the plug and it's still ringing up high. Get that pin pointer. It's supposed to be in the plug. right there and it's a quarter it's an old quarter though that's the question I don't know it's dirty so a little scrape on the pants it rang up kind of high so let me see if I can see the date on this I'll get back to it all right it's so that quarter I got just right there it was a 1989 and then this plug Next to iron right there, at a high tongue right here, found another quarter. This one's a 1985. Hoping we can get a little bit earlier than that. But may have to title this one Taco Money. Alright, let's see how much more taco money we can get. Okay guys, I didn't record this one. It was another 84 signal, so I knew it'd be a quarter. I found the other two quarters right under that bush right there. And I'm right here, and I just brushed it off. Oh, we're getting uh, earlier. So those two were 80s. This is a 68. So we're getting closer to silver. And uh, so that's cool. Let's hope we find some. So guys, I've uh, moved to the back side of the mansion. Uh, I've also changed my machine to the Knox, just so everybody in the neighborhood didn't get to hear my signals. And I had a 30, solid 30 on the Knox, which I am doing field one. And I have my recovery speed high, but um, I just didn't change it. And I got a quarter, and that thing was way down in there and it's a modern quarter and it's a state quarter uh, one of them looks like it might be north carolina yeah first in flight 2001 so yeah sometimes the new stuff is deep i mean that's a good eight inches right there all right man i've moved on from behind the house because that's how i roll <laughs> and up by that shed is where i found the 80s quarters just on the other side of it and to the left of that was the 60 quarter and I just found another quarter this one's a 67 it looks like or it could be an 87 I think it's 67 yeah so we're still in the 60s but not the 60s we want <laughs> it's not silver so two 80s quarters two 60s quarters but not silver 60s but we're gonna keep looking. I know over in this area, last time I was here with Marilyn who lives across the street, uh, we found some relics. So I'm hoping to find some more. This might have been where they burned their trash because it did find melted uh, lead and aluminum and stuff. So hopefully find some more relics. See you in a bit. I figured it was only fair I live dug uh, one of my signals with the Garrett, so I'll dig one with the Knox. Probably a quarter. I would say probably not silver. Now it's starting to, you know, as soon as you turn the camera on, the signal goes everywhere. All right, let's see what this everywhere signal is. There's also, oh, I lost my spot because there's little um, bits of fur here. <laughs> Somebody didn't survive probably a cat attack I don't know but that's fine all right so it's right here so that's what we're gonna dig I can't believe I lost it that quick See if we got it in the plug. Ground's a bit drier right here. 
Yeah, now it's in the plug and it sounds like real crap now. So let's dig the real crap out and see what the real crap is. What do you say? Not easy to do one-handed. There's a worm. So it's right. There it is. No. Nope. Trying to see if I can. There it is. All right. What kind of crap did we find? Looks to be a dime. It's a rosy. I don't think it's silver. think so but it's a dime okay, it's just over there somewhere I just dug a 1995 quarter <coughs> and I uh, finally dug a weedy see the one cent on there I don't know if you can see it on camera it's right there I don't know the date yet it's a little, a little dirty a little bit dirty I have to get some of that off, but I'll get the date and let you know in the next hole. Hey guys, I just popped my plug for a penny signal. Uh, I didn't just find the penny. Okay, so the penny I just found was right there. It's 1949. And I went to go get my pinpointer out. You can see the little dent in there where this one was at. This is a dime. Don't think it's silver because it rang up pretty low. Rosie right there So I'll get a date off of this and I'll let you know It's only a few feet from the, the Weedy might be silver Might be I have to clean it off and get a date. I'll get back to you All right, we'll try dig in love the moon one more time Got a nice 31 32 here It's right there so let's see what it is. Probably junk. Because I turned the camera on before digging. But let's see. Got some rain coming this weekend, but the ground's still a little more, you know, a little wet. Some people don't like the word moist. Alright, still inside the hole. So, take out the trusty dusty end pointer. Oh, it's right there. <laughs> yeah. I thought it might be a quarter, but it came in pretty high, so I was hoping it would be a silver one, but I don't think it is. I don't think so. Looks like 80. Nope, 1966. Two years off. We keep getting close, but no cigar. 1966. I guess it's better than 1996. Alright. You ever start swinging? Get a good signal. Look for your shovel. Which would usually be in your hand while you were swinging. And realize you didn't have it. Yeah. I'm that person. I'm the person that forgets the shovel. Alright. Just an example as to why you should be wearing gloves when you dig old home properties. That's not even old, I don't think. But my signal's somewhere way in there. Right there. It's probably the top to that. It was like a quarter signal. And you can see the rocks from the old driveway oh there it is there it is it is a memorial penny all right hey guys so i moved across the street from the school and the mansion which are both over there to a house built just before the turn of the century and i got my first good signal I would dig with you, but it's a little difficult, so uh, it's a 28, 
I've dug a couple signals so far and they were flashing and uh, a weird little I'll show you hang on Let's see. so flashing from the roof old flashing now some kind of weird little clip thing which I might not be able to get to in my bag no I have to show you afterwards so I'm gonna dig this up if it's anything good I'll show you this is a little bit of the house back here it has been detected before but it was years ago and you know back then they pretty much only dug the high tones so maybe there's some high tones they missed who knows let's hope so see you in a bit peace one more time see if it works just okay so it's working my gopro has been acting stupid so i'm at the back of the house i had a lot of iron in this signal but i dug it anyway because i heard one solid tone in it and it's a penny it's not a weedy it's a memorial but it's a 1961 so i believe by 1961 they were memorials i don't know offhand but i didn't see weedy on the back so i think it's a memorial so at least it's old i'm gonna check out around here a little more all right guys <laughs> i believe this one deserves a filming i'm still behind the house i had a mix between 28 and 30 and i'm sure you see a little gleam in there i just put my uh pinpointer in there and moved some dirt around looking for it but dudes this is a symbol silver this is silver. This is a silver thimble, guys. Yeah. Holy crap. It was like, I don't know if you can see the impression right here on the side. That's where she was sitting, just like that. And I put my pinpointer in there and moved it. Holy crap. There's the markings right there. That is a silver thimble, my friends. Oh my gosh. I gotta record for TikTok. Alright. This is too cool. I never, you know, never thought I'd find one. Right there is where I found the thimble. Right behind the house. And I just had a, yeah, it was like a 20 signal on the Knox. At first I thought it was a salt shaker, but I'm not entirely sure because of the back. I mean, it could be. I don't know. It could just be squished. But it's cool. I'll brush the dirt out later and show you. But just to give you an idea, let me shut this up. <laughs> I should have put that dirt back in there. I'll just slide the dirt around. Ooh, there we go. Give you an idea of what I'm listening to. This is what the area I'm hunting sounds like. In case anybody's curious. Yeah, pair up my headphones again. Alright, see you in a bit. So guys, I didn't film the thimble, but I have a high tone right there. Mix in with trash. There's like trash everywhere. I don't know if you can see the numbers, but there's definitely a solid signal. When I'm not filming, it's solid. Only when I'm filming, it's not. So I figured we'd look for it together. Last couple have been nothing. This looks like. Um, maybe part of a suspender? Well, that's it. Oh, across the street I found an earring similar looking. Now I find this. Whoops. Whoop! Looks like it might be the suspender clasp, maybe. Or just an aluminum ring. I don't know. When I clean it up, I'll know. 
Okay, uh, my GoPro's dying, so this may, I may be ending soon, but I just took that thing out. It's still a signal right there. A little shaky, a little all over the place, but it's worth checking out. This was probably the trash area, bottle dump area at one time. So let's see what this is. Yeah, it's just a piece of aluminium garbage. See if there's anything else in there. No, that's that's what I heard. Everything else in here was all iron tones. I mean, we could check together, but I think it's more trash. Yeah, let's see. Who knows? Who knows? We don't know till we dig it out, do we? I mean, I wasn't expecting a silver thimble. There it is. Let's see what we have here. It's a little piece of copper. Uh, I wipe it on my pants. You guys can look at that hole for a minute. It's like a little finial to something or something. Definitely copper. Hey, little. All right. That's probably nope. There's more in there. Probably more trash. I didn't hear too many good signals in here. Whatever it is, it's deep. All right. Hey guys, just a real quick review. This is from my last time, so I have to clean this button for that video. So you'll see it on that video. Uh, so from the church, the 1850 Mansion Church Catholic School. Whatever. So from the 1850 Mansion Catholic School, closed Catholic School, we got uh, two dollars and quarters, forty cents in dimes. Nine cents and pennies, two EDs, and this thing, which is a it's interesting. Then from the house, we got this possibly is well some kind of shaker top, some kind of finial, sixty-one penny, a whole bunch of trash, probably a wine. Aluminum that goes around the top of a wine bottle. I don't know, it's got a design. But the superb find of the day is the silver thimble. And I looked up the maker's mark. There's several different types for this maker. This one appears to be the one from 1851. So, and this English, Manchester, Birmingham, or something. I don't remember offhand now, I have it on my phone, but you'll find out at some point in the video. You either know now or you'll know later. Pretty cool. I'm stoked. Nice design. It's squished because it was actually on the edge of their driveway in the back of the house. So they've been driving over this for who knows how long. Alright. Peace.